to create a new scene you can either click on this scene new scene or press the shortcut ctrl n or you can just simply press this plus icon right next to this word scene it will also create this empty new scene and now in this scene you can just simply create an object right now we are going to add a character body 3d which will be responsible for making our player movement so let's click on this other node and let's search for character body 3d so now i'm going to rename this to player and we need to add two more components the first one is the mesh instance which is going to be the physical appearance of our player and then lastly we are going to add a collision shape this will be the bounding box for our player so that the player can collide with other stuff right now it's giving me an error saying a shape must be provided for collision shape 3d to function please create a shape resource for it so to fix that we are going to select this collision shape 3d going to this inspector create a new box shape 3d so go to mesh, mesh instance 3d go into this mesh drop down and select new box mesh and now you can see this if you don't like this grayed out environment you can always enable the environment and the light let's give this mesh instance a material to create that there are multiple ways you can either go to this expand this one and create a material from over here or you can create a material inside the file system so right click new resource and search for standard material 3d and just create it it's going to ask where you want to save the file so let's just create a new folder and let's call it materials i'm going to call it player mat and let's save it and now this material is now saved inside of here so if you double click on it it will show these properties of the material now expand this albedo group and change the color of it so i'm also going to give it a nice blue color like this okay now to apply this material onto this object we simply drag and drop this onto the object and the material has been applied the other way is just to create a material into this thing over here and just simply selecting this one you can also save this one by just right clicking and clicking save and saving it over here but we have already created that so i'm just not going to add it over here as now let's save this player scene by ctrl s go back in the scenes folder and let's save it player scene is now ready